It's like buying a used car and they go, I want to let you lift up the hood. That's the problem in the market today. There are some good ones out there, but the bulk of them don't want to have to show you how it's done. And most importantly, they don't have the capability, cash or methodology or technology to show you during the lifespan of a carbon credit when you need it, when you want it at will, show me the carbon today. Am I buying something that is just air? As we move to a capital markets solution like NDC, Nationally Determined Contribution Financing, basically. In financial markets, people touching data is a no-no. People touching data is when fraud happens and it's human nature, you can't avoid it. And the voluntary carbon market in particular is based on human intervention to validate or verify what's going on on the ground. I mean, we can see it, none of us here can touch it. We can't change it. We can go back in time and let's change this number. You know, when it comes to data, it's no humans in the loop. It's a very clean statement. We can say that to any bank, any corporate buyer. When you see our pricing, see our data, look at our valuations, look at data pedigree, this is all done by machine, no humans in the loop. At scale, we're totally indifferent. At the end of the day, it's about transparency and it's about investor choice or user choice at the end of the day. Am I buying quality or am I buying junk? I don't own it. I don't have an invested interest in moving the credit. I'm the infrastructure, I'm the plumbing in this market that lets the product move and we can account for it. 